I did not start out with the idea of doing volume. In the early years, there were only five Ironmans in the world. And that first year in 88, I did all five. But after that, I only raced two or three or four times a year. However, this year, I'm racing 17. The three top moments from Iron Man. John Rag. I think the first time you ever cross the finish line, it's exciting. That was New Zealand in uh, 1988. And I crossed the finish line and I felt like I died and gone to heaven. But I guess uh, my hundredth, and the reason it was the most memorable was because Elizabeth and I crossed the finish line together. And after that, she gave me this ring and we both have matching rings, and that was to celebrate the 100. What was the real aha moment? Um, it was 2013, it was in Kona, and we crossed the finish line together. I have the photo at home on the wall, and if I ever get down in the dumps, I look at that photo, and that makes it real. That was the pinnacle of, of our career, I think. Well, you know, I never expected to meet anybody on a race, but um, I just started Ironman. I had a couple of girlfriends. I went uh, to Arizona. It was my second race, um, and I uh, finished. So I'm in the mess tent having pizza after the race. So I decided that I needed something to eat. I went to the mess tent. And this lady comes up to us and asks, do you mind if I join you? John turned around, looked at me and smiled and... Uh, there was an emotional connection there. And uh, that was it. And I get really emotional when I talk about it. It was wonderful. He came out to Vancouver and we ran the marathon together, fell in love and the rest is history. So Iron Man is very special to me because it brought me the joy of sport, uh, friends and a friendship and love that will last a lifetime. Louis, Jeff and myself are the only three people in the world who have done all the Ironmans that have ever existed and next year Elizabeth will be able to add her name to this t-shirt and there will be four of us who have done all the Ironmans in the entire world on six continents. John, you know what? He's got so much left in him. I mean, anyone who can finish 17 Ironmans and do his 200th in a couple of weeks in Cozumel, he's still so focused. He's so athletic, you know. He's just, uh, he's an amazing machine. He just keeps on going. This was our very first Ironman together nine years ago. So we're back for our honeymoon on Saturday together. Yeah, it changed my life. Yeah, it did. Yeah.